What's up guys, Goldberg here, and today we're just taking a look at the uh, Champions pack from League of Marvel Super Heroes 2. Now, this is um, a new pack that just came out today. It's like two bucks for non-season pass holders, and for season pass holders, 100% free. Really, really cool. And uh, we'll be checking out uh, characters such as Amadeus Cho slash Totally Awesome Hulk, Sparky, Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, Ironheart, Nova, Viv, Wasp, Nadia Pym, Moon Girl, and Devil Dinosaur, who I have right here. So, I'm a little frustrated right now because I just recorded a 16 minute video and the audio didn't record. Because why? Because I'm stupid and I didn't actually have the microphone plugged in. So, I'm going to be redoing this entire video. Oh boy. All right, so we're starting from the end this time. This is Moon Girl. So, we'll kick off with the best ones, to be honest. Uh, so, she's got this really cool melee attack, which is really, really neat. Um, and now I've read all the cards, I know the stories to all these people. I didn't know much about the champions at first, but she's got a little electricity beam, which is really neat. And she's got a hyper jump and flight. So, she's a really fun character, to be honest. She's got a lot of cool, unique animations. I'm really enjoying her. Um, she's got a little skate animation, and we've also got Devil Dinosaur here. Uh, now I do have a lot to say about Devil Dinosaur, because this camera control for him is quite odd. Okay, it's cool that he's got a sprint and all, and it's really fun, but the camera loosens, if that makes any sense. It goes to, like, this, like, weird free camera, and it just starts to drift. And it's, it's kind of odd, but at the same time, it's really not that bad. It's just, it's just different. I guess it's, it's definitely probably better than the original Double Dinosaur camera, but it is kind of weird. Like, if you, like, push on the joystick for a couple seconds and then let go, the camera keeps keeps drifting, and it's kind of like this free-moving camera. Though it is neat. It's very fun. It takes a second to get back into normal camera mode. So there's Moon Girl and Double Dinosaur. They're really cool. Uh, they've got some unique abilities and such. I'm really frustrated, and I really don't want to go back into these cards, so I mean, I'll just briefly go through them. She's got Grapple, Repair, blah, blah, blah. No one really cares, to be honest, I don't think. She also has a Targeted Lunge, unless you guys want to see these things, then let me know, but I'm mad. Um, she's got a Targeted Lunge. Alright. Uh, Devil Dinosaur, blah, blah, blah. Cool. Uh, we'll go back to the beginning. Uh, we've got Amadeus Cho. He's pretty awesome, I gotta say. Um, oh yeah, by the way, the story between Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur. Moon Girl's like, uh, Lunella or something, I think her real name is. She's really smart. She's like an inhuman or something. And then she built a portal and Devil Dinosaur came out and they formed a bond. And now they're part of the champions or something. Um, so Amadeus Cho has this little, uh, I'm, I believe it's like Hercules Staff or something. And I guess it shoots like purple lightning, which is kind of cool. And he's got some really cool unique animations and stuff. And he also pulls out this little, like, Nintendo DS, and that makes a force field somehow. I don't know. Um, so that's pretty cool, though. He's a cool character. The whole triangle, or Y, playing on Xbox. Nintendo Switch, I have no idea. Um, Amadeus Cho turns into this dude. Totally awesome Hulk. Now, he's pretty cool, because he's not just a normal Hulk. He's got a little energy-charged slam attack. And he also has the wonderful... Electro clap and uh, so yeah, he's got hyper jump and stuff too. I don't think I need to demonstrate that, but I will anyways That was a bad idea switch characters before I fall in the ocean. All right, so That's totally awesome Hulk. It's pretty cool. Obviously he has the abilities that you'd expect him to have technology super strength whatever and uh, Yeah, so pretty cool stuff pretty cool stuff. It's got toxic goop protection and what's not Moving on, we'll do Sparky, and we'll also switch to Viv. Viv Vision. Okay, so these guys were created by the Vision, apparently. And so Sparky's a little dog that, like, flies and stuff, and Viv is, like, a 16-year-old girl Vision. There's more to the family. I guess these are supposedly the most important ones, I guess. So Sparky flies, which is the coolest thing ever, because that is just playing awesome that we have a flying dog in Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2. He's just a really fun character. He's got quick teleport. He's, he's pretty awesome. Uh, the design, I don't know how specifically it looks in the comics, but I mean, the design kind of creeps me out a little bit. I mean, those are just dead soulless eyes. 
and it's a green dog with no other like patterns really on him it's kind of kind of scary looking um we got viv over here she shoots a little mind blast mind beam she's essentially vision with a different skin uh she flies so that's viv she's pretty cool though i mean it's cool design and stuff um essentially just vision though um so you know what ability abilities they would have i so let me check sparkies he might have something cool i think he just has like teleport quick teleport uh he's got technology uh targeted lunge okay and dig tracking and the teleport of course which i demonstrated somehow he has captain america's shield all of a sudden not sure how that works then we'll move on to kate bishop and wasp uh so here's wasp not a pym essentially just wasp she shrinks she's got her little bioelectric sting blast which is pretty fun she flies she's got the black and red awesome looking design which is a lot cooler than i think the normal wasp in my opinion however when the ant-man and the wasp pack comes out i think we'll have a competitor for the best wasp character uh so yeah she's pretty cool uh she's the daughter of hank pym she grew up in like soviet russia or something and then she escaped when she heard of her father built this wasp suit and became the new wasp i guess uh then we got kate bishop over here um she uh she's essentially just hawkeye again with a different skin um she's got her hawkeye abilities she's she's, she's just hawkeye she's there's really nothing that special about this character honestly uh it's cool that you can put away and put away our take out and put away the uh bow but i mean that that's about it for her uh what's her story i think i don't know she was trained in swordsmanship and archery and then she stood up to captain america and then captain america's like yeah only hawkeye did that he's like you could be hawkeye and now she's hawkeye so hawkeye kate bishop there you go uh moving on to ironheart this is the wonderful ironheart riri williams um uh, she's she's iron man she's got photo mode which i did not know the original iron man had in the first place but apparently he does and so does ironheart uh she does she does what iron man does uh just with a different standing pose and that's about it and different skin um once we wait here for a couple seconds she'll do her little uh board animation and she'll take off her helmet but she does not transform unfortunately like the tony stark character does kind of disappointing makes me a little sad but you know it is what it is she's got this animation so i mean that's kind of cool you know she shines her helmet that's pretty neat so moving on we have last but not least right yes last but not least definitely not least nova so he shoots little blue energy blasts really nice to have nova in the game love the new helmet design he's got his um blue energy shield i've never been a huge fan of nova but i mean he's grown on me over the years i think and he's definitely really fun in this game um I kind of like his little run animation. It's a little different. Uh, some of the animations they use are reused, but they add the cool-looking blue streak, and it makes it more worthwhile. Hey, get back here, Taxi. I want to beat you up so I can show everyone the... Oh, there we go. The melee animation. So you've seen this before, probably. Yeah, you have. Um, who is this for, though? I know I've seen it before. I think in LEGO Marvel's Avengers. Uh, but yeah, you've seen that before. Not with those blue streaks, though really cool stuff honestly um this pack honestly does have a lot of cool characters i mean moon girl devil dinosaur amadeus joe sparky and nova are all definitely make it worth it it's only like two bucks if you have the season pass totally free go download it it's out now and uh it does have portal free which is cool but you guys probably know who nova is if you don't i don't know much about him so let's take a look shall we uh, following an accident suffered while searching for his missing father, Sam Alexander awoke in a hospital bed confronted by Rocket Raccoon and Gamora. Oh, okay. They revealed to him that his father was a member of the Nova Corps, and after finding his father's helmet, trained him to harness its power, now named Nova, he has fought alongside the Avengers and the Nova Corps, and is currently a member of the Champions. Hey, that's a shocker. Everyone on here is part of the Champions. So, um, there you have it, folks. That is the Champions pack. It's really, really cool. Definitely recommend it. So, anyways, guys, thank you guys. For, don't don't forget. Thank you. Blah, don't. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys all later.